All right, you guys, so I'm starting a brand new barbecue series. Right now I'm in Dallas, Texas, and I wanted to take you guys to one of my favorite barbecue joints, Smokey Joe's, okay? So we're about to check this out right now. I'm gonna show you how good it is, tender, juicy, you know, all the things that I look for in barbecue, and you guys can let me know what you think, if you like it. But let's go, come on. Hey. What's going on? Hey, Shout out to my homeboy, his name T-Bone. Oh, T-Bone? Yeah, uh, he's a handicapped. He, love, he loves me. Oh, he loves me? He loves you, girl. He loves you. Well, I'm tell him I love him, too. All right. <laughs> I'm, about, I'm about to take a picture. I'm going to take a picture. It's crazy. Okay. I like this. You can't buy happiness, but you can buy barbecue, and that's kind of the same thing, and that's, like, my personal motto, too. Gotta it's got to be right. I don't... Oh, we can definitely take pictures. Mama, you go ahead, man. You can take a picture. What's your name? You didn't my even tell me Anthony. Anthony. Anthony, Demetria, nice know, to meet know, you. Know, know okay. You well, we have to we have to introduce ourselves okay, to each okay, other, and me. we're gonna take this nice selfie, right? Oh, yeah. I'm all halfway nervous. Stop. Oh, is that? Oh, that, okay. So I get calls from that same number, yeah. the spammerist. Thank you. Of course. Have a good one. Enjoy yeah. your food. All right, let's let's order some food. This is what I like about barbecue places too, because it's like, if it's too fancy, that's not good barbecue. This is real simple. You walk in, you see what time it is. You see the benches, that's where you eat. This is where you order real easy. And me, I'm more of like a, a brisket, like burnt ends kind of person. Like I know people like pork barbecue, but me, I'm big on the beef. And we're in Texas, so we have to, we gotta try the beef. All right, so I'm looking at the menu. And I want, I don't believe I want. I'm dying. <laughs> it's for here. <laughs> We're doing some shit. So I'm, yeah. I'm leaving a tip. And I left a tip. But I want some barbecue sauce on the side and everything. Thank you. I gotta get the sauce. Okay. Appreciate you. Thanks a lot. I'm dying. That's cool. So we got this. Okay. And it's very, it's very important because there's Smokey Joes and there's Smokey Johns in Dallas, so you better get it right. I'm gonna need anything else. This looks amazing. Oh my God. Okay, so I love brisket. You need to see how juicy this brisket just came out. And then they have the shells for the macaroni and cheese. Look at that. Look at that. No, really, you know what I mean? Like, I'm excited right now. Oh my God, hold on. No, like, I just, being from Kansas City, you know I'm picky and I always talk trash about every other city's barbecue. Nothing's ever good enough, but this right here, and they got the nice, good, just cake smelling bread. I love that. Pork ribs look juicy. The beans look delicious. So I just gotta get straight to it. But the mac and cheese, like I'm, I'm a kid at heart. Where do I even begin? Like this isn't even the, you know what I mean? I'm gonna be clean about it cause I got a white tee on, but oh my God, it's just falling off. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. This is what we like. I'm excited. Oh my God. This is crazy. They got the good classic music on too. The whispers. Yeah, what y'all know about this? I'm gonna leave y'all in anticipation. Hold on, this is a gift. I'm just like. Oh, that's really good. It's moist, it's juicy. Because I'm not gonna lie, because coming from KC, I'm gonna tell you like, my idea of like Texas barbecue is always like dry. They be like dry rub. It's dry. You need a glass of milk to drink, eat with it. Like this is on point. Oh my god! I try the mac and cheese. Oh my god! Hold on. That's season right. It's like Alfredo, like mac and cheese. This is my song. Hold on. And they playing good music, and I'm eating good food. I'm happy right now. Okay, beans are different. They're kind of like a Texas chili beans. That's a little different for me. Um, let me see. I like it though. That's very filling. And now I'm gonna try a little pork rib here. I'm gonna have to do the close up for this. That's some good Texas pig. Okay. <laughs> I was, I'm, I'm recommending this place. Like I'm saying, come here for real. I definitely recommend Smokey Joe's Barbecue in Dallas, Texas. The brisket, like I told you before, I'm a beef person. Absolutely juicy, moist, crusted. I loved it. The pork ribs, I don't even really like pork ribs, but these pork ribs definitely get my stamp of approval. Now this mac and cheese, you just gotta come here to try this mac and cheese, cause it's not like a regular mac and cheese. And if you really like barbecue, you know a lot of barbecue places with their mac and cheese, it's all dried out. It looks like, I don't know, like hamburger helper mac and cheese. This is not that. These are not the same. Yesterday's price is not today's price. Like this right here 
it has that Alfredo weenus to it, and so it's so different. Like it had me eating, I had to watch myself because I have more barbecue that I gotta try on my little mini barbecue tour out here. And honestly, this guy behind me, he has like this gigantic baked potato. I don't know if you guys can kind of see it a little bit. We might have to zoom in. Huge, major portions and very polite, kind service, and I really appreciate that because we walked in here with the camera and I, they, they weren't tripping. And please come here with a bigger appetite than I did because I made a mistake this morning eating breakfast because I'm having to take all of this to go. And let me know what you guys think of what you saw. And if you live in Dallas, you gotta come out here and try it if you've never been. All right. Oh, it's a lot. This is good Texas meat. We can't let that go to waste. Make a really thick, delicious sandwich of this. That's crazy. Good pork rib. Gotta get the bread to kind of soak up all of the goodness. That's how we do. Right there, gotta take a sauce to go. Cause I, you know, from Kansas City, I love my barbecue sauce. Like I gotta have that. But the meat didn't even need sauce. It really didn't. And that's the, that's how I like my meat. All right, let's get some of those good peppers and stuff. Cause I had never seen that before. I had never seen that before. Like usually only at the hipster barbecue places they have that. So it's kind of cool that they have it here. Cause it, it makes the, the acid breaks up all of the fat in the meat. So it's kind of like refreshing and crisp and crunchy. And we like that. Thank you though. Uh, rain or shine, we gotta get our barbecue. We're good. We're on our way to the next barbecue spot. So I'm really excited to check out this other place. It's called Smokey John's. I've actually tried some of their barbecue, but it was so many years ago when I was working on the news in Dallas. And so now I'm gonna check it out. I, I think it's gonna be dope. Oh, oh wow. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my. Moist catfish. Okay, look at the jiggle. It's got that Tyler. Make me swim. Make me smarter. The Brit special though. <laughs> I'm really fortunate I didn't get anything on my white tee. I, I want to be able to see the fit. Like, I got the Tim's on, like, I came ready to barbecue. And then I'm gonna get a side of, uh... <laughs> if you have, like, dentures or anything like that, this meat is for you. Like, it's coming right off the bone. I need this on the plane. 